Oh, baby, we've been shopping. We've been shopping. So, I went to Ross today, and I just want to show you what I bought. So, if you want to see all the goodies that I was able to look up on, just stay tuned. <music> Okay, so we just now made it to Ross. We're about to go inside and see what we can find. Fingers crossed. Hopefully, we can find some goodies. But let's go see. Hello, loves, and welcome back to my channel. Curvy Doll here. If you're new, welcome. And go ahead and subscribe and hit the post notification. I end up having to do a voiceover because my baby was watching TV too loud. So let's get into all right, and the first item, let me get this bag. Let me get this bag. All right. So the first thing I bought, you know I'm addicted to slides. Who are, who's not addicted to slides? I bought yet another ooh, pair of slides. Puma slides. Green is my favorite color, so I had to pick these up. I wear a nine, nine, I wear a nine and a half, ten. So I was scared, but when I put my foot in these, they fit perfectly. So I got me a nine. It was the only pair, and I was going to be hurt if I could not fit these. I also, now this was a whole bop, okay? This was a whole bop, a whole vibe. I can't wait to wear these. I cannot believe I found these. These are some deep KMY tennis shoes. Look at these. I, I don't know. Look at these. Come on now. Just get into it. Take a moment. Do y'all see these? The glitter, the graffiti, the details. This is Donna Karen. Ed Ross. DKNY. This is a whole box. These are so pretty. I fell in love with them. I could not leave them in the store. Um, where is the tag? I don't know why the tag is not on here. I don't even remember how much I paid for these. I believe they were $40, $45, I'll look at the receipt and insert the price. But these was the highlight of my week. They are comfortable. They are, you can dress these up. You can dress these down. This is a whole vibe. If you don't have nothing else, you know, let me tell y'all something. I'm a white t-shirt girl. So I would throw on a white shirt with some, with some um, skinny jeans or some jeggings or some leggings and she out the door. So to so find these, don't play so. Go check Ross and see if they have some in your area. Now I only found one 10. They had a five and a half and a seven and a half. Now if you want me to go get you some, just let me know. Cash at me and I'll mail them to your girl. If they still are. Now this was this was Monday. It's Sunday. So I don't know. I don't know. If they still there. I'm just saying. But yes. I love these shoes. They are so pretty. I cannot wait to wear them. I don't know where we're going in this quarantine. But I'm going somewhere. Somewhere in those shoes. So. Alright. And the next item I got is for the house. Uh, oops, it's upside down, boo. It's just this Chanel picture. They had it in turquoise and silver, but my room is uh, gray, white, and black. So this one fits my room. I absolutely love this. I was thinking about making me one. It's a DIY video, but I decided once, since I found one, I don't have to. Now, if you guys still want me to make that DIY video, just comment down below and I still may do it for you guys if you want that. So, this, it was $10. nine nine nine. Chanel. What you mean? 
I couldn't have made this for $9.99. Period. I only needed one. One. $10. That's a whole box. Stop playing with me. But yes, I love this. I'm, I've been wanting to hang it up so bad. I, since I bought it, but I said no, I gotta record this video for y'all. So yeah. <laughs> um, the next item I got was just some essential oils. I bought a um diffuser. Is that what they call? Yes, a diffuser from Aldi's a couple of weeks ago, and I have not been on Amazon to give me any oil. So I found this pack of four for $9.99. They had some packs for like six in there, but they were smaller bottles. This is more like a full size bottle to me. Um and it has lemon rose. It says lemon lemon is purifying. Rose is calming and soothing. Jasmine stimulates creativity and the sage increases clarity and um groundness so um when i record these videos or i'm having a bad day or big getting on my nerves i need to read the back there and see which one i need to pour in there to give me some woo side because baby between these children and and bay and stress and this quarantine because who need a vacation is me i need a vacation like two months ago if i don't see a beach in the next two months i'm gonna go crazy crazy so hopefully this will keep me calm <laughs> and i can make it um the next thing i bought was these i never seen these before but when it says keto it draws my eyes now i'm not keto anymore i'm low carb it's a big difference i'm i'm getting ready to start a keto channel so i can go over everything if you want to um, follow my weight loss journey. I'll put a link down below. I have set the channel up. I have not recorded for it yet, but it is set up. Go ahead and subscribe. But these are keto cookies and there's a variety pack. There is lemon blast. There's Hawaiian peanut butter and chocolate chip. And it is coconut based with the coconut um, flour. I've already eaten the lemon I had to go look the listen to find a keto cookie that is good it's moist it reminds you of a regular cookie a carb filled cookie this lemon cookie has eight carbs three fibers so five net carbs the hawaiian one has eight carbs three fiber uh so five carbs the peanut butter one has nine carbs three fiber come on now you cannot beat this for the whole cookie and these are good my favorite is the lemon blast in hawaiian i had to google them i went on amazon they did have them on amazon but it was like a variety pack and i just want the two now these peanut butter and chocolate chip were good but i just fell in love with the hawaiian hawaiian is almost like a um white chocolate macadamia cookie and a lemon is lemon but they are so good if you guys see these and you're on keto or you want a low carb snack this is this is it okay get you some and then thank me later and if you get them go ahead and go ahead and tag your girl on instagram so you know, tell them, you know, tell them Curvy Dog put you on to them to them cookies. And they're by uh Bake City, y'all. And you can Google them, order the box. But I suggest you try the smaller box to make sure you like them. I love them. Um then the next thing I found was some cheddar crisps. So this says girl say quinoa. Okay. So we're gonna have to taste these in another video. So these are cheddar crisps. They're made with cheese. It's a snack. You can use them as a cracker. I make my own. 
Girl, let me see what's in here. Because I thought this was keto friendly because it has nine carbs. You can have seven pieces. Oh, okay. Well, it's not keto because it has brown rice. Um, It has organic oat bran and it has the organic quinoa in it. See, mine is just straight, just cheese. And these are thin, crispy, cheesy crisps. Um, I got them because I wanted to try them with some guacamole. I wanted to try these with um, some tuna fish, some chicken salad. Anything that I use a regular chip for or a cracker, I wanted to try it with. Some seafood salad, anything like that I wanted to try. It. And this is the um, cheddar flavor. They also had a savory seed parmesan crisp flavor. I got this too. These were on clearance. They were one dollar. Um, originally three ninety nine. So you can't go wrong with a dollar, even if they are nasty. They were a dollar, boo. It's okay. It's okay. Just a dollar. And then, oh, I got two. Oh no, this is different. Is this different? They look different. Okay. Okay, so this is cheddar crisp with quinoa, and this is cheddar crisp with sesame seed, poppy seed, onion, and garlic. So it is different. I was like, the cracker looks different on the front. It's got to be different. So these are the three that I got. They are low carb, not keto. These are low carb, but um, they work for my diet. I'm gonna try them. They were a dollar. Can't go wrong, even if they're nasty. They're a dollar, three dollars for all three. What you talking? What you mean? What you talking? Oh, I. Right. Yeah, so I'm definitely gonna try these guys. If you wanna, if you try these, and um, let me know how you like them down below in the comment section. Um, and if you know of any other good low carb keto crackers, please let me know. I've been looking for some. Um to try because i love crackers and i miss my um club crackers so much my ritz crackers i miss it all right so that concludes our come shop with me ross hall i hope you enjoyed it go ahead and share the video comment like subscribe share this with your friends and i'll see you guys in the next one bye Thank you.